Max, uh, two all draw here at Ashton Gate. Uh, what is the sort of feeling in the dressing room among the boys after this? Um, we're disappointed, uh, obviously, to come away with the with just a point, but um, it could have been worse, and we could have we could have lost the game. So we're just um, glad that we could get the final goal and um, come away with a point. Yeah. Yeah, but once again, I mean, we've seen it so many times in recent weeks. The lads showing really good spirit and a good mentality to come from behind again. And what, what can you say about that? Yeah, it's like a never say die attitude. Um, come out and uh, like we feel like we're never beaten. So even if we go a goal behind or two goals behind, we always feel like we can get back in the game with the players that we have, even away at grounds grounds like this, tough places to come. So yeah. But looking at the performance from the boys today, is there disappointment with how we played on on the day? No, I think um, it was tough. They tried to nullify what we do. You could tell that they'd watched us a lot before the game and uh, tried to cut out the areas that we're good in. Um, and we we tried to create things, but uh, sometimes you have to you have to take a point. Yeah, I suppose with us being near the top of the league, teams are going to do that. They're going to look at what we do well and try and uh, nullify that, as you said. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, when you're top of the league, teams take note more of what you're doing. So you can see it. They turn up and they uh, they really want it. So, but yeah, we'll. Um, We'll look at what we can do better and go next week. Yeah, we spoke to the boss um, just a while ago, and he said you were you and a few of the boys were suffering a bit of um, flu. Um, just how did you feel throughout the game? Yeah, it didn't feel the best, but uh, it happens. You're gonna have games in the season where everyone's not 100, percent so um, it's just it's just one of those things. But then again, with the lads suffering from um, flu, he sort of speaks more about the sort of mentality of the boys and the spirit that we've got to sort of fight and get a result when we're not all at it. Exactly, um, we backed each other through the game and uh, if people were a bit ill here and there, um, we always felt that we, we were, st were still strong and uh, we, could, we could get through it. So yeah, it says a lot about our mentality. Um, and once again, you're uh, popping up with another goal. Uh, I think, that, is that three now you yeah, scored uh, this season? Yeah, yeah, three. Yeah, um, you're making goals a little bit of a habit yeah. and um, a little header at the back post. You must be pleased with that. Yeah, yeah, they always come quite late on. So just, just tried to get in at the back stick and... Um, Luckily, I know putting a really good ball and I can get my head on the end of it. So, yeah, really happy with a, another goal. Yeah, and you and the boys must be pleased with the impact some of the subs made. Because the Arnell was only on the pitch for a couple of minutes and he showed, um, you know, really good cross for your goal. And it shows the sort of competition that there is and everyone has to be on it, don't they? Yeah, we've got massive depth in the squad. So, when people, even Grant came on at the back, Jordan Rhodes, uh, like everyone, everyone that came on contributed to the, in the, the game and getting a point. So, yeah, it just shows the depth of the squad and um, how big a squad we've got, which is, which is really good. Yeah, and you've spoken to us previously about how important Grant is um, to for you young, younger lads. How pleasing was it to have him back on the pitch and have his leadership there? Yeah, great, definitely. Um, he's been out. He's been a bit unfortunate with being out of injuries and stuff like that. But great to have him back, and it just adds to the um, competitive nature of the squad and uh, the numbers we've got. So yeah, really good. Yeah, and a word on our fans. I think we had a 1,300 here today um, with the game being on telly and a long journey. They came out in their numbers and they really got behind us, didn't they? Yeah, really good. Um, obviously, it's not. It's a, it's a big big distance to travel over here from, from Norwich, so yeah, we're just thankful that the fans could be here cheering us on through the game.